I literally just woke up and I had to come by my window to find the best lighting in here because lighting sucks in my room apparently. But anyway, um, I look like shit so I'm gonna get off of this thing now and I'm gonna go get my face and things together to get my day started so let's see where today takes us. Oh, hey y'all, my bad. I had to get that thing shut up really quick because it's really loud. But as you can see, oh, let me come back by the window. I'm dressed and ready to go. Just got on track pants, some vans, um, chambray top. It's got an extended hem on it, which is really freaking dope. But, um, yeah, that's about it, so I'm about to go get some breakfast from somewhere. I don't know exactly, but I'll let you guys know when um, I get there. Bring you all along. Right now, except going to get breakfast. I hope I have my wallet. Right, make sure to follow Knowing me, I left it at home. Like, I'm going to have to turn around and go back and get it. All you have to do is text the special keyword that I announced. I have to turn around and go back home. I say it around 120 to 5 to 1 on hip-hop NC.com. Check out what's trending in the city. And then I have to stop because my retarded ass forgot what I was saying. Oh, yeah going on guys I'm really upset right now just because I didn't win Kendrick's cash that thousand dollars did not go in my pocket and I'm pretty upset about it talk about oh you can win Kendrick's cash if you text the number to the damn well text the um, keyword to the number and I did that and they just called somebody else. <laughs> I know, mad petty, but it's annoying because, bitch, I need a thousand dollars. But anyway. Delicious ass biscuit. Something the tea came in with hot water. So it's like really good, y'all. I'm shocked. This may be the new breakfast spot. Maybe y'all think. Of course, I'm working. You can see Cameron Village and all of its worth. So yeah. I'm in love. Like, extreme love. All of that. Because it's like really effing good. Mm. I have homemade blueberry jam. Like, homemade. Nothing was in the package. Fresh berry, all of that. And the fact that this tea came out like this, I'm gagging. Gagging. Wow. I know, day drinking is probably bad, but. I got a Mai Tai. Don't judge me, bitch, until you've lived my life, okay? I have to get a Mai Tai because I really like them, oh, man. I wanted to try it. Okay, y'all, so I'm here at the breakfast place. I'm getting out of the car now to 
go inside and get me some breakfast. Do y'all see this lighting from this sun though? Damn. But what's up, y'all? I'm just out for a little try. Nowhere to go in particular. Probably gonna go look at the property. Um, I'll just have to be cool, sorry. But yeah, I'm probably gonna go look around for some properties. Um, you know, just get out and enjoy the day a little bit. Um, like I said, I don't have anywhere in particular to go or anything in particular planned, but I have wanted to go to a couple of neighborhoods just see what's available because I'm about to get my real estate life popping. Good morning, y'all. Well, good late morning, considering it's damn near 11 o'clock. I've been up since eight and I still have not had no damn breakfast in my life, but we're just gonna leave that. I had to get some money out for breakfast. And it just really upset me that I bought this meal. No, I saw a homeless man. There we go. I saw a homeless man and he asked me that I help him get some food. Hold on, y'all. Okay, close the door because I'm vlogging and I don't want anybody in charge of my vlog. Girl, damn it. This elevator is so stupid. Okay, so like, he asked me could I help him get some food? And I was just like, no, I don't know if I can or whatever. And then he proceeds to, oh, jeez, this is not where I needed to go. Excuse me. It's just the worst day of my life. <laughs> it's just one of the worst days of my life. <sighs> oh, one, two, is a three. There we go. Oh, That's a break. Is it over? Almost. Oh, it's almost over. Oh my gosh. Shit. Okay. I got this way. But anyway, so I went to the ATM machine to get some money because he said he needed help getting food. And I was like at first kind of sketch about it because I don't typically, you know, I, if a homeless person asks me for money, I don't give them money. I get them like food or like direct them to a particular resource which would help their situation. I don't know if you guys can hear me this loud ass shit back here. But yeah, so I get money at the ATM and then like, I just decided, fuck it, go ahead and get him some food. Bojangles is like right across the street instead of giving him some cash because I was not about to give this man a $20 bill. Like, fuck that, it's not happening. So, Lord Jesus. I get the money, go get him a, um, what is it, like a four piece Supreme dinner, you know, something quick, something like, you know, getting me through the line or whatever. And I bring him back the food and he's just looking at me like, first of all, I didn't even say thank you or I appreciate it. Just looked at it and was like, I mean, I just wanted two pieces of chicken. I was like, it's four pieces of chicken in the box. And he was like, are they chicken strips? I'm like, yeah, dumb, dumb. Like, obviously it's a four piece Supreme is four chicken strips. So I think this elevator might be the one I need to take instead of that other one. So yeah, like, he gets an attitude, and then he's like, I can't tote all this stuff, just keep the tea. Like, how rude. But anyway, I'll get back with you guys when I get the food, because I'm starving. What up, Pete? So I'm back. So I'm walking my usual breakfast spot hopefully it ain't fucking extremely crowded in here because it's damn parade all uh, this shit that's going on 
hate parades. I hate when there's crap loads of people out and about. Like, they don't have ish to do. But yeah, I'm going to enjoy this mess because <laughs> it is cold. It's not freezing. It's not New York cold, but it is cold. Dirt than usual. <laughs> On this woman to pull her happy ass out this parking side so I can take her side. That's why I sat here. And I'm in the way of the drive through. Come on, girl. Damn. Try and get your parking spot. Or is you just going to sit here? Because I'm concerned at this point. If you're going to be petty like that, that's disrespectful as hell. You done got your shit. Hell, move. Oh. I'm getting there. Go. Get the hell out of the way. I wish they would. Anyway. Because I sat here and waited for this spot to open. Petty or not, bitch. I need a spot, ho. Okay? So that's how that go. And that's it. Just get the hell out the way. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. 